hello everyone welcome welcome back to my channel today i will be discussing 15 physical education csec questions so please subscribe subscribe tell a friend like and you can also comment all right let's get to it aerobics as a physical activity contributes best to flexibility endurance or balance you will see me pause a little in the video for you to think about the question and see if you can get the answers correctly before i say the answers right so let me read back this one aerobics as a physical activity contributes best to answer is endurance Next question. The ability to change direction quickly while moving relates to agility, speed, reaction time, coordination. Which one do you think? Change direction quickly. Answer is agility. Next question. Which of the following best describes the body system beyond normal capacity? Is it overload, specificity, progression, or reversibility? Overload is the answer. Next question. Nicholas can perform badminton technique almost effortlessly. This skill learning phase is called, is it cognitive, beginners, associative, or autonomous? Good. The answer is autonomous. An individual maximum heart rate is dependent on the person's age, fitness level, gender, skill. Would you consider all of them or would you consider some? Okay, the answer is one, two, and three. You must consider the age, the fitness level, and their gender. When performing pull-up, what type of contraction occurs at the biceps? Remember the biceps are at the front of the arm right there? So what type of contraction occurs? Is it isotonic, isometric, isokinetic, or involuntary? Answer is isotonic. Very good. In which of these tests should a professional gymnast excel? Gymnast looking at. So it is sit and reach. Carla walks four miles every day. Which of the following would she improve the most? The answer is cardiorespiratory fitness. The movement of the arms and legs, which causes the entire body to move forward while, while immersed in water, is known as... Which one would you say? The answer is streamlining. When a bone at a joint is forced out of its normal position, what condition is it called? It is called dislocation. Next question. A inch joint allows which one of these movements? Flexion and extension. Very good. Which of the following joints allow movement in one plane only? It is a inch joint. All right, the muscles which relax to cause movement are called 
Which one would you say is answer? Antagonistic. Is it? It is antagonist. Which of the following is used as a source of energy in the absence of carbohydrates and fats? Answer is proteins. Which of the following is a benefit of regular physical activity? Regular physical activity. It increases triglycerides. Okay, I hope that you have learned something. So please remember to just touch that subscribe button for more questions. Thank you.